That is the CDHK, otherwise known as the Cold Dead Hands Karambit. The tool feature is something that we kind of came up with as a means to solve a problem. One is we wanted to come out with something that was kind of cutting edge. We wanted to, mm -hmm. you know, I always want to do something innovative. I want to do something a little different than what's already available. You know, there's other notable designs out there that are able to work as a catch out of the pocket. We wanted to design something that could be used that way, but not be the necessarily the main focus of it. So, and that's kind of what drove us to put our heads together and think about, well, what about a tool feature that we could attach, not just something that would be used to be able to wave something out of your pocket or, or uh, catch something out of the pocket. We wanted to actually design a tool feature that would work with the product that maybe alternatively you could use tactically, whereas most of the time you would be using it practically. These two holes in here, which are locator holes for these two pins on our tool attachment here. The tool attachment has a rare earth magnet in it. So this is a very strong magnet. And yeah. you can see as I barely even just kind of introduce the bit to it, I mean, this thing, is, it's got a really great magnet to it where it just kind of holds it on there. What we've seen in some other designs is people will put shapes of, you know, like wrench shapes and stuff in blades where it's not really that practical because, you know, if you've ever turned a wrench, you know that busting your knuckles is kind of part of the deal if you're slipping on something. The last thing you want to do is be holding something that has a sharp edge on it. That just adds a bit of danger to it. Oh, yeah. So thinking safely, we added this rotating little bit here that would come in and actually grab the tool but you'll notice as we put this on the back of the blade here and put these pins through when those come in this comes around and actually locks this tool attachment to the blade this can't go anywhere you can take the tool and put it in where that rare earth magnet is that actually locates and holds it in position with this piece here, and everything's just really super locked in. It's a very robust tool design. Yeah. And then you can use it safely by keeping the knife closed and using it this way. You don't have to worry about a sharp edge being anywhere within, mm -hmm. within your working space. All right, so this is an so, added feature. This is something extra. This is definitely. not to replace no. your toolbox no, or none no, of that no, stuff. No, it's just an no. added value thing. And I mostly use this on my guitar when I'm tuning it. So this isn't something that I'm out, you know, fighting crime with or out building houses or yeah. doing anything. Like, this is not for industrial use. For me, it's just like a any other kind of multi-tool. You know, you actually can very practically carry this yep. this way in your pocket and it's really easily used as an opening feature on its own. So several different design aspects to this and several, several different uses as well. The thing that I appreciate most is that this is something that after you're done with this, and if you want that option to take it off, I mean, you have the option of taking this thing off. And once you do, you know, we do have a pouch that comes with this. It's also got the nibs as a complete kit. You can either stick that in your pocket, throw it in the dash in your cart. And it'll, and accept, it'll also accept uh, any, any quarter inch. That's any quarter the, that's inch awesome. Yeah. Yeah, Let's this see that? You go to Lowe's, you go to Home Depot, yep. wherever you want to go, this is a standard quarter inch bit and it'll take any one, whatever any your one. regular kind of, I use, like I said, I, I've replaced my packet with the ones I use for my guitar, but um, you could replace it with the stuff you normally would use on your bicycle, you know, that kind of stuff. Thinking about it like a practical, a practical and tactical, tactical product yeah. because, you know, Yep. When you're on your bicycle, you might use it just as much mm. to tighten up a screw as you might on someone trying to assail you or rob you. To me, I couldn't overemphasize because complaints that I had is, well, th there's no grip on the back of the ring. I said, then let's put some jimping on here. You know, so that's what we wanted to do. Uh, Did that come from Filipino martial artists by any chance? Yeah, because they wanted that grip. I wanted to make sure the edges on here were cut perfectly not smoothed out at all because I wanted that added extra grip. To me, this is truly my complete ultimate knife, at least for a Karamid. And something that Mike thought of, instead of putting a window breaker on one end, we decided he wanted to do it on this end. And I love it. I mean, it's great, especially for knuckle dusting. Having it in this position right here, it's just super comfortable. It's yep. not going out of your hand. You, you're, you're in complete control. Even somebody that's, you know, more petite or a woman or, or someone or a younger kid mm -hmm. or whatever, holding it this way, you're, it's really secure and, you know, you could do something like break glass with it pretty pretty effortlessly. And uh, yeah, also obviously used as an impact device. And we actually chose 154CM, which is a wonderful steel made by Niagara Specialty Metals. 
and um, I've been friends with those guys for years. We've used it on several of, of the products that I've been involved with from Spyderco up through Blade Tech and Fox and every company that I've been involved with on some level has used that steel as a go-to really middle grade exotic utilitarian use steel with really high performance and cutting. So that was something that we had chosen and we decided to go ahead and procure that specific steel made in America and then send it out for the production. So that culmination is what led us to this awesome price point.